the meantime, a remarkable recovery for an Orange County woman who was infected with COVID-19. She says the experimental drug she received made all the difference. KCO 9's Rachel Kim spoke to the survivor and the scientist who is cautiously optimistic. I just feel incredibly blessed to be here talking to you today. It still gives me the chills when I think how close to death I was. 55-year-old Samantha Mote has come a long way since we last spoke with her in early April. That's when she had just gotten out of the hospital after a grueling battle with COVID-19. She was critically ill on a ventilator in the ICU where they tried two experimental treatments that didn't work. Her family then turned to Dr. Otto Yang from UCLA's Geffen School of medicine, where he's leading a clinical trial of a drug called Lamab. It was first developed to treat HIV, but is now being used as a potential treatment for COVID-19. Literally 60 hours after being injected with Lamab, I was off the ventilator. But after about three weeks, um, I've been back, I'm back to normal. I'm riding my bike six miles a day. Uh, I'm back to riding my horse and being with my horse. Uh, I feel like my life is the way it was before I had the coronavirus. Dr. Yang says Lamab is an artificial human antibody that works against the second phase of COVID-19. That's when the body's immune system overreacts in response to the virus and causes inflammation in the lungs, which makes it difficult to breathe. We saw quite a few of the patients seem to improve and you know, a lot of the physicians across the country that were using it uh, had the same experience. Uh, however, those are not controlled studies, so we don't have a comparison group. We don't have an exactly equal group that got no around the map to be able to compare and say it definitely had an effect. Dr. Yang tells us controlled studies are underway and they'll have to see if it works on everybody or whether it works on just certain people. There's good scientific rationale for why it would work, and I think a lot of us you know, feel like there, there is uh, strong circumstantial evidence that it does. I truly believe in this drug. It saved my life. Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News.